Now, what is it we achieved before when we were doing the spiral in and out? Yes. Yes. And in a proper bend, which is, you know, sometimes a bigger task than we think it is. Certainly more of a task to him than we, we'd like it to be. Good. I would use a little indirect rein right now with your left hand. Go up across his neck towards your upper outside shoulder and ask him to bring his cheekbone over. He's avoiding the difficulty of the exercise by being a beautifully athletic horse and tilting his nose to the outside. Yeah, so come up across his neck. It's not a jerk, let go. It's a bring your hand in this position and move your fist and wrist around until he actually releases the cheekbone. Yeah, really active inside calf. Come and trot. And I'm not falling on my nose with my trot. Thank you. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. And a lot. Good. Now as I push him out, I reach my 20 meter mark at the canter on the 20 meter circle. There was a nice chew. He finally got his neck in the middle and then he lost it. Too bad. Good. Watch him meet him. Fault that outside rein. Yep, bring his eyelash to the inside of his neck. Can you notice as you look over both sides of his neck, you see almost his eyeball on the outside. Do you see that? All right, we got to fix that. Yeah, Come. knees off that tack. Good girl, Autumn. This is about riding with your leg, not your joint. Your calf bones on him. Good girl, there's your canter to part. You just got him really straight. That was really nice. He's that sensitive though, isn't he? He felt the knee pinching like, oh, I gotta twist my neck. You know, every time he twists his neck, open the knee again. Beautiful, good boy. Bravo. Rock him onto his bum. And half halt, head turn. Good girl. Now on the 20 meter circle, Autumn, I want your chest way higher. And remember how in the walk we talked about the oscillation of the seat? There's a little up, down on the inside, outside, inside, outside. Instead of your bum being back, 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 and your arms having to pull, I want you to sit on the back, be an equitation rider, open your knees, give yourself room to get nestle up into the pommel of that saddle with your butt, your tailbone. Thank you. Good job. Now spiral in and out without tipping forward, without leaning on your pubic arch, which is the front of the pelvic bone. Make the back of the pelvic bone nudge up into the pommel of the saddle. Your knees will have to stop pinching. That means I actively have to pull them away. Yeah, it feels insecure, I know. Good job. Can you move your fists a little? Yes, you can. You didn't know it until you tried it though, right? Super, good boy, good boy. Now, as we push him out, be sure your outer leg doesn't go forward or he'll misunderstand. Yes, into the outside rein. A little more alive on your fist in the outside hand. Now, we're coming to grips with a big movement. Good boy, good boy. And forward into trots, immediately spiral in. He's gonna wanna twist his head. We all know it, open your knees. Yep. Outside rain can make a half haul, but it's not hanging on for life. I am way too slow with my thighs. Get moving yourself, Autumn. You can do this.